residents in Ilorin, the state capital, see the Eid celebration as an opportunity for quality family time and making uh, an opportunity to catch up with their kids. Now, they spoke with Trustee Visagir Ibrahim, who was at the Diamond Amusement Park in Ilorin to experience the fanfare as well as the celebration from this year's Idil Kabir. Take a look. Idil Kabir is a day set aside for the remembrance of the sacrifice of Prophet Ibrahim. However, the day after, some would say it's a day set for kids. And that's why we're at the Diamond Amusement Park here in Ilorin, the Kwara State Capital, to observe the fanfare a day after the Idil Kabir celebrations. Stay with us. I'm here to celebrate the Kabir with my family so that I can make them happy, so that it will be a remembrance day for them. So is this how it usually is every year, the crowd, the number? Even today, the crowd was not even like the way it used to be. Uh, for example, in the uh, last uh, festival, which was uh, in the victory, the crowd here was so much. And uh, although the cost of living is very high, it's not easy for common man to get to survive. But nevertheless, whatever we have, we like to make our children and our family happy. It's fun, isn't it? Well, there's more. <laughs> to celebrate Salah and today being the second day of Salah and the children are on holiday so we we, we feel is uh, their right to come out and enjoy themselves before they go back to school you know it's not something they do every day so once in a while like this it's good to go out enjoy yourself free yourselves from stress ah, that's just why we are here well there you have it it's a time to free yourself from stress but most importantly a time to make the kids happy hello what's your name my name is joseph your name is joseph how's the salah celebration uh, i don't know but are you having fun yes that's the camera girl. say hi to the camera hi why are you here today i'm here to today because to have fun with my friend with my sister and with my baby girl so alhamdulillah i'm here today so i so come here to to thank god for my life today i'm so happy and so alert. Hey, this is honestly too much fun back to the interview i brought my kids to come and enjoy themselves and you know this is a lifetime experience and it's once in a while it's not something you come every day so even if, if it's for me to save for them to be here to make them happy i think it's something worth doing so and i feel excited bringing them here because there are many people out there that don't have the opportunity to be here but for me to be here with my kids is something i have to be happy about and they too i believe they are happy about it and then we have one coming out hi what's your name abdrashid aisha aisha are you having fun yes where are your parents hmm? where are your parents hi say hi to your parents hi and there you have it, another happy kid. You know, this is the in the cabin, the, the largest uh, festival for our Muslim. So, and the, what, what, what we call it, it is something that just make make uh, your people around you, they don't feel among, they don't feel alive, and then let, let them feel happy. Because at times, if you just keep the children at home, giving them food only, in fact, it can cause a lot of damage for them because they are not exercised themselves. Them, them, them but we assume now, maybe by the time now you give them food now, let them exercise their body too, so that you not end up in the hospital. Because the money we spend here now is so lesser than the money that we spend at the hospital. Now they are very happy now. Even though if, if there's there somebody among them that if he fever before I left home, now it's not right now, everything disappears. The cost of living is something to talk about. The cost of commodities in the market is also something to talk about. However, one thing that all of the respondents bear in common is the fact that children come first and nothing is too much to make them happy. From the Diamond Amusement Park here in the Laurie, the Choir State Capital, Sagi Ibrahim for Trust TV News.